Hiya guys, back again with the Vapor Vader. Today for review, we have the absolute juice. We have a red apple, a lemon and lime, an orange and a grape. These have been sent over for the purpose of the review, but as always, it doesn't change my opinion guys. If it's shit, I'll tell you it's shit. So, these juices, uh, in this one it says there is no apple, it's an imported juice, it's a 7030 PGVG 55ml premium e-liquid. All the warnings on the back, which is always nice to see. Your normal ingredients, vegetable glycerin, propyl glycol, natural and artificial flavourings and sweeteners. These, these are all 0 milligrams. I'll leave a link in the description where you can pick these up guys. So, without further ado, let's get into it. As always, we'll be doing the review on the Vupu Drag with the Narca. So, I'll go out, I'll rewick, and I'll come back, guys, and we'll have a look at this Absolute Apple. Right, guys, so we're back with the Absolute Apple. Let's give her a rip. Got a very nice sweet red apple here guys, it is what it is, I think with the absolute juice guys it is what it is, it's an absolute juice, it's just one flavour or a couple of flavours done really well, standard juice, exactly the flavour that you're expecting and it is, it's just like a sweet red apple, it's very nice, I can't say much more about it guys, it is a red sweet apple, so that was the red apple, we'll now do the lemon and lime. As I said, this one's got two flavours in it, but it will be just lemon and lime. There's no undertones, there's nothing interrupting it, it's just the flavour that it says. So, I will go out and re-wick and come back and show you the lime. And as always, guys, we are using the Fuzz Cotton, for Fuzz Cotton from Yorkshire Vapour. And I will also be using my Coilmaster V3 kit. I'll go and I'll re-wick and I'll be back with you shortly. Right guys, so we have the Lemon and Lime Apple by Absolute Juice in the Vupu Drag. We're running at 70 watts on the Narca at 0.32. Let's give it a rip. Oh, you can't beat a good wet wick, guys. That's what she says. Right, that's a really, really nice flavour, guys. I'm having a little vape on that one. I know for a fact already I've lost this juice. I know this will be going to Mrs. Vader's brother because it's a very nice lemon and lime. It's up his speed. Um, I would say it probably tastes a little bit like the um, oh the sweets. I can't remember what they're called. Yeah, those little square sweets. They were called opal fruits when I was younger, but I'm showing my age there, guys. I think they're called Starburst now. But, yeah, I think it tastes like the green Starburst. As I said, when I was a kid, they were called opal fruits. Put a comment down in the below if you remember them being opal fruits and whether you still call them opal fruits. I know when my kids get them, I still call them opal fruits. But yeah, good juice, guys. Anyway, let's move on. Enough for the waffling. Um, we will come back with the orange by Absolute Vapes. I'm going to go re wick. I'll be back with you shortly. Right, guys, so we're back. We're all wicked up. My wick's wet. And uh, we've got the Absolute Orange. Nice and saturated. Well, let's give her a rip, give her a pull, give her a suck, whatever it is you like to do. Pop it in your mouth and let's have a taste. I was a little bit reserved about this one, guys, because I'm not usually a big fan of orange vapes. This one's not half bad. It's not as good as the other two by far. I think the apple and the lemon and lime are better. But it's quite pleasant. It's making my mouth water anyway. Um, I wouldn't say an orange juice, I'd say more of an orange sweet, like a, a sweet orange, it's a very nice orange, but it's not the best, but it's nice for an orange, as I say I don't normally vape orange, for an orange would I recommend it, yeah I probably would, but we'll get into all that at the end anyway guys, I'm digressing, so we'll come back and we'll have the grape on there, can't be a bit of grape, well depending on what sort of grapes you've got like, but you know, those of you that suffer with piles, you probably won't like the grapes, but never mind. I'm going to come out, re-wick, and be back again, guys. Right, guys, we're back with the Absolute Grape. Still on the Vupo, obviously, with the Narca. All dripped, all ready to go. So, without further ado, I'll give it a little vape. This is the last flavour. Shh. 
it's not the best grape I've had, guys, but I have been doing some really nice grapes lately. I've had some really nice ice grapes from uh, other companies. Um, Chemical Clown did a really good one. Um, there, were a few, there were a few different companies that did some good ice grapes, but I have got to put this in its own category, guys, so I'm not going to try to class it as a bad vape because it's just that it's not an ice vape. There's no, there's no coolness to it. It is just a grape. All these are just standard grape. You know, no mint. Uh, no mint. So there's no mint in any of these, guys. It's just, I don't know if they do a mint version or not. You might have to have a look. There will be a link in the description to go pick these up, guys. Um, but as I said, it is just a standard grape. It is nice, guys. It is a grape. It's okay. But I would personally rather see some uh, cool ardor in there or some menthol. But that's just me. That's my preference. It's all subjective with all this. So let's bring them all back, guys. The order that we uh, vape them in. Um, I think I'm pretty much going to leave them where they are, guys. Mm, maybe a little tweak. There we go. I would say the lemon and lime is the best one. I'd give that a good strong 8 out of 10. I could all day vape that easily. The red apple, I'll give it a 7 out of 10. I could vape that. Probably not all day, but I could vape it. Probably majority of the day. I could probably pick it up at dinner time and vape it for a while. Probably vape it into the evening. The orange, it's actually quite surprising. I don't normally like an orange vape so much. It's not like I dislike it like I do with mango. But it's 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 okay, it's pleasant, it's nice vape, I could pick it up and vape it, but it wouldn't be something I'd vape all day, maybe a tank phone, that'd be me done. The grape, it's not really for me guys. It is a strong grape, good grape, nice flavour. But I would I well I probably will use it guys. What I'll probably do is throw some menthol in there maybe. Or maybe some cool larder. Just because that's my speed, that's my that's what I like, so it is subjective. None of these are bad juices, guys. I would recommend checking them out, see if you like them. That one, probably not so much. I'm not saying don't go and buy it. I'm just saying for me, I'm not very keen on that one. If you want to go out and buy it, that's fine. They're not a bad juice. It's just not for me. These, good solid flavours. Check them out, guys. They will be in the description. And that's pretty much it, guys. As I said, these were sent over for the purpose of the review. But as always, it doesn't change my opinion. It doesn't make me like this one anymore just because they were sent for free. So, as, uh, as we always say, guys... I have been the Vape Invader, stay off them stinkies and join the vape side.